Euclid Book 1, Proposition 4. If two triangles have two sides equal to each other, namely this side equal to this one, and this side equal to this one, And if the angle that they contain is also equal, then the base or side of those triangles here will also be equal. And also all the remaining angles will be equal to each other. In high school geometry, this rule is known as SAS, side angle side. So if you have matching side followed by a matching angle and a matching second side, then the triangles will be equal to each other. Euclid proves this by conceiving the two triangles to be overlapping at this common vertex such that this side is also matching between the two triangles. Then this side over here will also overlap on the second triangle because their contained angle was identical and in particular these vertices will also overlap. Therefore the base here must of the two triangles must also be equal because if they were not equal if the two triangles did not completely overlap here there would be an area enclosed between them and by axiom 10, two straight lines with the same endpoints cannot enclose an area. Therefore, this side is equal to this side. And also we'll have this angle here being equal to that angle there. And this angle here being equal to that angle here and the two triangles will be equal to each other in every respect.